are dealing with that heat and poor air quality right now. Those two elements can be dangerous and even deadly. Our Ellie Bird spoke with a doctor to find out how to stay safe, even if you have to be outside when you maybe shouldn't. When temperatures are rising like they are right now across East Tennessee, some jobs stop for nothing. And if you have to work outside, it can be very dangerous. Experts say to follow these tips to make sure you are staying safe. A double whammy. So we've got the smoke from the fires from Canada and then with this heat. So it's creating this almost this dome which is trapping in the smoke and so um, it's making the air quality a lot worse than it normally should be. Josh Mims is superintendent for Capstone Building Corporation. He and his team cannot avoid working outside. He says they're prepared for extreme heat or extreme cool. It don't matter really what you got on when the heat gets as hot as what it is now, uh, but you definitely want to make sure that you're taking care of your skin if it's exposed, sunscreen, um, and the biggest thing is just staying hydrated. Some heat exhaustion symptoms workers can experience are nausea, dizziness, weakness, and sometimes much worse. Mims says he holds weekly safety meetings to make sure everyone is in the know and they can coordinate breaks so no one gets sick. We want everybody to go home the same way they come in the morning. If you suffer from respiratory or heart problems, you may be more at risk with the high heat and poor air quality. Doctors recommend staying inside as much as possible right now and try to carpool to cut commutes. Car emissions can make the air quality even worse. In Knoxville, Ellie Bird, WVLT News.